Hello, this is Dave at TitleSearch.com. In this video, we're going to talk about what is MERS. MERS is an acronym, M-E-R-S, it stands for Mortgage Electronic Registration System. Uh, it's a uh, third-party, non-government database created uh, in the 1990s by the mortgage uh, industry, by mortgage lenders. What it does is it was intended to streamline the secondary market for mortgages. So let's say if a certain bank uh, lent out a mortgage, they may want to transfer that mortgage to another bank later, maybe sell off their portfolio, uh, maybe do different things with their loan packages. And in the past, what they had to do in each case is take the mortgage that they recorded on the title and assign it on the title to another bank or another lender. And each one of these assignments turned out to be very inefficient. First of all, you had to pay somebody to go down and record a new document. You had to pay recording fees. Uh, you had to pay somebody to draft the document. And since they were doing these in much bigger volume than they were in the uh, 80s and 70s and prior to that, uh, they created this streamlined system. Now by itself, the system really doesn't create any problems. It's just transferring ownership or interest in these mortgages between one bank or lending institution or even financial institution and another. It actually helped the mortgage industry become more liquid so loans could be uh, turned out faster by the lender. If a, a broker turned out a mortgage and they weren't actually going to be the end user of that uh, loan, they could instantly sell it to another warehouse company and then go back right into lending and not have to worry about it. So the mechanism itself did not create the problems. Uh, some of the problems associated with MERS have to do with the outsourcing of the foreclosure process, whether it's robo-signing, uh, whether it's uh, the servicing, where there was some less transparent uh, contact with who is in charge of that foreclosure or that uh, robo-signing or processing the loan or servicing the loan. In most cases, um, the, the fraud was not due to MERS or the lender. It had to do with the outsourced companies. So MERS by itself uh, was a pretty good idea to make things more convenient for both the borrower and lender. It's just that there were growing pains uh, within MERS uh, in the first decade when they, the volume hit stride in the mid-2000s and the lenders had to figure out how to deal with that. So MERS is a mortgage electronic recording or registration system. If your loan or mortgage is within MERS, there's certainly ways to discover who the end user uh, mortgage company is. MERS itself uh, has that ability to do that. And as part of a title search, we often will look to see who the underlying uh, funding company for the MERS loan might be. If you have more questions, you can reach us at our website, titlesearch.com, and we'd be glad to help.